Yeah, I guess you're doing the theoretical part of your work right now, so you must miss the practical part of your job, which is acting. So, um, what's your favorite monologue? <laughs> My, I have two really like two monologues that I really enjoy doing. Um, one is a monologue from the movie Three Hundred. You remember that movie? And um, the other monologue is one from V for Vendetta. All right. So do you want to do one of that for us? One of those, sorry. <laughs> you guys want to just give me work to do since I'm jobless. Is that it? Yes, well. man. We're just trying to let you do your well. job. <laughs> okay, great. Um, give me a second. <clears throat> A humble vaudevillian veteran cast vicariously as both victim and villain by the vicissitudes of fate. This visage no mere veneer of vanity is a vestige of the vox populi, now vacant, finished. However, this valorous visitation of a bygone vexation stands vivified and has vowed to vanquish this venal and villain and vermin, vanguard in vice and vouchsafe in the vow that vicious and the voracious violation of volition. The only verdict is vengeance, a vendetta held in glory, not as a way, but the value and diversity of such shall one day vindicate the vigilant and the virtuous. Barely this vicious war of verbiage bears most for boast, so let me simply add, it is my very good honor to meet you, and you may call me V. Thank you. Amazing! Hey. Naomi, you should pay us for engaging you. <laughs> the other way around now. Like we're engaging should, your mind. I should pay I should pay you. Yes. <laughs> yes now. Yes. That's that's a new one. That's a new one. I should pay you for acting. Okay. Well. <laughs>